Also today, it's the heart of every annual meeting, the poster sessions. presenting a poster from work done at the University of Virginia. This poster is a series of cases of uh, microcystic adnexal carcinoma, which is a tumor described in the skin, very well described in the skin, and we're presenting cases of it occurring in the mucosal surfaces of the head and neck. This is a poster uh, where I'm, uh, I have described morphological findings that are seen in very early complete molar pregnancies, and we have compared these findings with uh, uh, partial mole and non-molar hydropic pregnancies. We selected about 100 cases and uh, we evaluated morphological features. I'm here from Josh Hawkins to present uh, my poster. Uh, the title of uh, my poster is uh, uh, PET can reliably distinguish uh, aggressive but not low grade from reactive uh, lymphoid tissue. So um, PET is commonly used for the um, staging of the lymphoma and SUV stands for the standard uptake uh, value. Um, so we, here we try to see whether SUVs can be used to di distinguish aggressive lymphoma uh, versus low-grade lymphoma and aggressive lymphoma versus reactive lymphoid, lymphoid tissue. Yeah, basically uh, we want to look at the uh, mismatch repair status in the, the current low-grade endometrial carcinoma. So uh, low-grade recurrent endometrial carcinoma is not very common. So we look at uh, 10 years and out of 1,600 85 cases and we found only 87 cases are the current and out of these 87 cases only 16 are the current at the vaginal cuff. It's great to have our research uh, presented here at USCAP because it alerts other pathologists to new developments. It's also been exciting because we've had a number of pathologists from institutions around the world approach uh, us about this project and let us know that they've seen similar cases, which will send us uh, hopefully to add to our case series and uh, increase uh, awareness about this entity in this new location.